Hip, hip, hooray! The bird has been freed! At least according to Twitter's new owner, Elon Musk, who has officially taken over the company. And as his first act as the new boss, he thanked everyone there for their hard work. Before firing their asses! Within the first hours of him owning the company officially, he cleared out all the big executives. CEO Parag Agrawal, gone! CFO Ned Siegel, axed! Top policy executive Vijaya God, history! Though don't feel too bad, because they got tens of millions of dollars in their exit packages. So now, this is a big private company, and he's gonna run it the way he wants. Yep, but just how he plans on doing that is a little confusing. He said, on the one hand, he wants to get rid of the extremes on both sides. And then on the other hand, he's kind of this libertarian guy who says, I want to open it up to everybody. Those two things are really inconsistent. You apply the rules fairly, one, and then anything that's extreme on either side, you stop it. What happens when Donald Trump comes back and he says the election was stolen because of all the corrupt uh, election counting machines? Which is false, just false, it's a lie. Do we, does he just let that allow to stay up there? Yeah, we don't think even he knows the answer to that yet. But with the CEO now fired, one question about Twitter arises. Who's running it? All the other people pick up the slack, just like here. Another cog in the wheel. <laughs> Um. <laughs> I've never legit seen him so quiet. No, I'm just, I'm co-signing on it. It's not extra work, it's extra opportunity. That just happens to come with a lot of extra work. Good luck with the new company, Elon.